Well, good morning, friends. It is my absolute delight to welcome you to the first ever Community Over Code North America. My name is Rich Bowen, and I will be your master of ceremonies throughout the rest of this event. Um, I've been hanging out around the Apache Software Foundation for about 25 years, and we've been using this phrase through most of that time to talk about what we do here. We, uh, we build communities, and communities build code, and this phrase, community over code, talks about how we value community more than we value the artifacts that they produce. But of course, the phrase community over code has a double meaning, doesn't it? It's not just saying community is important, code isn't, because that's obviously not true. We are here because we build code. We build communities around code. And so that other meaning, community over code, it kind of reminds me of last night at dinner when we were building friendships over dinner. We are building communities over code. And uh, that, that double meaning of this name just reinforces what this event has been about since we started it in 1998. It's about building communities around our code because collaboration is what makes these projects work. So it is, it's really, really delightful to have you all here. Um, the first thing that I wanna do is to say thank you to some people. Um, and, and you know, first of all, I need to say thank you to my dear friends, Ruth and Brian, who did all of the work to make this happen so that I can stand on stage and take credit. Um, like everything we do at Apache, this event is a collaboration of volunteers. And uh, so I wanna, I wanna recognize the track chairs if, you all, if you're a track chair, if you could just stand up or raise your hand or yell something. Um, these are the people. <laughs> these are the people that are the actual subject matter experts and chose the talks and the arrangement of talks that you will be attending throughout this week. And I, I could never have done this without them. So thank you so much to those people. Uh, I also want to thank our sponsors. Uh, first of all, our platinum sponsor, Cloudera, who uh, made this event possible. Our gold sponsors, Bloomberg, Gradle, Instacluster, and Red Hat. Our silver sponsors, Apple and Google. And please do visit their booths out in the expo area. and. Uh, learn about their involvement in our projects. Thank you so much for, for helping us make this event possible. Um, today's tracks are, are listed up on the screen here along with the, uh, the track chairs. If you have questions about the content or about speakers, those are the people to get in touch with. Uma is actually not going to make it due to visa issues, um, but uh, there will be other volunteers filling in there. Uh, I do want to mention also, since we're getting this question a lot, there's a QR code on the back of your badge that has the information about, has lots of information about the event, including how to get on the Wi-Fi network if you haven't figured that out yet. So that QR code there is, is what you're looking for, for that information. It also contains information about discounts from local restaurants. If you take your, your conference badge with you to lunch or to dinner, and show it to the, the people there. If they're participating in this, you'll get a discount on your meal. And that's because Halifax is an awesome city that welcomes visitors. Um, the other thing that you'll find information on there is the lightning talks. Every year we do lightning talks. This uh, year it's going to be on Tuesday. If you have something that you would like to talk about in five minutes or less that is somehow related to this event or open source or software in general or the, uh, the MCs let you get away with it, then uh, please look there and sign up to give that presentation on Tuesday evening and uh, wear a Hawaiian shirt.
At the end of each day, in the talk rooms, there will be birds of a feather session. Now, if you're not familiar with that term, a birds of a feather session is just where people of common interests gather to talk. They're, they're not formal presentations. They're just places to talk and collaborate around whatever topic. These are the two that are scheduled so far. However, if you want to run a BOF this evening, then go to the, the registration desk and sign up for that room so that we can make sure the lights are on when you get there. Uh, and, and speak with Brian about that. Brian is over there in the back, um, and he will get you on the schedule for that. So I think that's all the, the housekeeping I need to do here. <laughs>